Good morning, everybody. It's a big day for the country. So do your part. Vote, vote, vote. And um, aside from that, let's work out. So we're going to repeat the band workout that we did last week because it got cut off last week and it was super good. And the end, the part that we didn't, my is here, finally, we missed you. Um, the part that we didn't get to finish last week um, is the ab section and it is tricky. So I'm excited that we get to do it today. So last week, if you're, if you're watching the ones from last week, um, we got through most of it, but there's about 45 minutes that got, it got cut off. So we're just going to go ahead and finish that. I am buying just a little bit of time to let people check in. But all you're going to need today is a mat and a band. I have two different bands, one heavy and one extra heavy. Um, only because my heavy one has kind of gotten stretched out. So I have an extra heavy bed. Um, you could do a medium and a heavy if you wanted to. And uh, to let you know the format, if you didn't do it last week, we have a combination of AMRAPs, which is as many reps as possible in a designated amount of time. And then we go to designated number of reps. Um, and then we go back to the AMRAP and yada yada. So each of the sections that is not an AMRAP is split into a different body part, legs, arms, core. And then the AMRAPs are cardio. So. Um, we're just going to get to it, and if anybody else checks in, we'll be happy to have them. <laughs> All right. Up and at them, guys. Let's get moving. All right. Make sure I have my bands nearby. So you can see here, I have a heavy and an extra heavy, and you could do um, a medium. Oh, my gosh. I've got Melissa here, too. Um, you could do a medium and a heavy, and that would be sufficient. So, um, good morning, Melissa. Woohoo! Hot dog. We have you today, too. That's fantastic. Okay, let's start by stretching out those legs just a little bit. I'm going to change my lighting. There we go. All right. Good. Morning, Melissa. Good to have you. We got Jennifer. And now the other leg. Pull it up. Engage that hip. Good work. Okay, let's go back to the original leg. Once you have it in this position, try to stabilize that core, pull your belly button in, chest elevated. You're gonna pull this leg out to the side. I want pressure in the, from the foot to the hand. Extend your foot into your hand, feeling that pressure there. Now release it, pull it back in, set it down. Good work. Now do the other side, pull it up. Find that stabilization, pull that belly button in, chest elevated. And pull the leg out, put pressure from your foot to your hand. Good work. Awesome. Now pull, pull this first knee up, fold it up here. Once you have it engaged into the hip socket, take it out to the side. We're just opening up those hips today because we're going to be using all the little bitty muscles inside those hip joints. Set it down, pull it up the other one, engage into that pelvic joint, and then open it up. Feeling it already today? I'm a little tight. Pull it back in and take it down. Go back to the opposite leg. You're gonna drive it back behind you, arms up. As you pull your arms down, set that back knee down to the floor, sweep it up. Back knee down to the floor. Give me a full arm sweep on this. Set it down, sweep, set it down. Sweep, good work. Down, up, down, up. Three more, three, two, Last one, switch sides, arms are up. Take it down, pull it down, exact same thing. Down and up, good work. Down and up, ow. <laughs> Just bang my knee into the floor. Good work. Three more, three, two. Last one, good job, take it out nice and wide. Lunge, deep, deep, deep lunge to the left side. Chest is still facing forward, shoulders facing forward as well. Take it up, over to the opposite side. Instead of staying down low, I want you to come back to neutral and then set it back down. Up to neutral, set it down. Up, set it down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down two more. Up, down, up. Now stay down and sweep it side to side. Good. Like you're skating, but your legs are actually not moving. Good work. Five, 
four, three, two, one. Same thing, but now you're gonna add in a hamstring curl. Stay down low. Curl and curl and curl. Keep those arms moving, curl, curl. Flex those feet, flex those feet. Four, three, two, and one, neutral. Chest comes up. Keep these hamstring curls, but come to me. Four, three, two, high five, take it back. Four, three, two, take it up. Four, three, two, high five, take it back. Four, three, one more time. Four, three, two, high five. Four, three, two, butt kicks. Let's speed it up a little bit. Good job, guys. Don't just jog in place here. Bring those heels up to your butt. Flex those feet. Feel those hamstrings engaging. Knees are staying down below you. Five, four, three, two, and one. Slow it down. Grab that band. Excuse me real quick. All right, let's see. Tim is here today. Nice to have you, Tim. Thanks for joining. Okay. <clears throat> so, you have... Um, the first section is going to be three minutes long. You have three exercises to do within those three minutes. You have three exercises. You're going to do each of them 10 times over and over and over. And then your ear pods just connected to my, it did. Okay. So, sorry. Um, so you have three exercises. You'll do each of them 10 times and repeat that process for three minutes. So if you grab your band, Put it around, you <clears throat> just above your knees, put it around your legs, just above your knees. Your first exercise, sit down, press it out, jump. Press out and jump. So 10 of those. Your second exercise is a bear jack to a plank jack. Bear jack, plank jack. Bear jack, plank jack. That's your second. Your third, you take it off of your, of your leg, bring it up to your arms, you're gonna pull it back into an archer's, archer's pull where the back leg goes with it. So pull it back, neutral, opposite side, neutral. Both sides is one repetition. Those are your three exercises. You have 10 of each over and over for three minutes, okay? So let's start by putting it around your knees. I mean, just above your knees. Let me get my timer started. Here we go, four, three, Two and one, take it out and press up. Good. When you do this, make sure that your big toe is staying anchored to the floor and so that when you press out, you're really using your thighs and not your, your knees to do the pressing. Okay, if the pressure comes right from your hips. Three more, two more, bare plank to jack, plank jack. So come all the way down. Bear jack, out to plank jack, that's one. In, out, that's two. In, out, that's three. In, out, four. In, out, five. In, out, six. In, out, seven, keep those knees low. Beautiful. Band comes off. Grab it with your arms. Right arm pulls back as left leg, as right leg goes back. Neutral. Left. Both sides is one. turning out, okay, but that you're pressing from your hips. Press from those hips. Yes, the band is on your knees. Yes, your knees are doing the motion, but the force comes from your hips. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. After you're done with 10 of those, bear jack to plank jack. Keep those knees low to the ground without actually touching. When you do the, the bear jacks, make sure you are actually pushing out with those hips, not allowing your knees to collapse inside. Press that band out. Press it. Archer pull is next. Good. So you only have 10 seconds left. Archer to jumping lunge. I'm a little behind because I stopped to talk to you. I'm just going to fake it. Five, four, three, two, you're done. Did you get all the way through two times? Jennifer, did you? No, not quite. Claudia, did you? Yes? Good. Awesome. Claudia killed it. Smoky, smoky. So, okay. <clears throat> Water break. Legs there first. So your next circuit, you're going to have five exercises. And you're going to do them... 30 seconds each, excuse me. <clears throat> Five exercises, 30 seconds each, and we go through it three times. I want to double check that to make sure. We'll do all five, you get to reset. We'll do all five, reset, all five, then you get done, we go back to another AMRAP. So, your five exercises with the legs, You're gonna start off with it up here just above your knees, and you're gonna give me two bear presses. So we're back down to there. You're gonna press it out one, two, then lift those legs one, two, okay? And you repeat that for 30 seconds. Two presses, two hydrants for 30 seconds. Your second exercise, I'm just gonna come back here. <clears throat> you will release the band from one leg. You're gonna pick which leg you prefer because you're gonna do it the other one the next time, okay? So here, I'm gonna just take it off my right hand, right foot. It's gonna take, you're gonna hold on to it. Whatever leg it's still on, that same hand holds on to it. You're gonna pull your knee into that hand and press it back. Pull and press, pull and press. That's your second exercise. Your third one, we're gonna call a TikTok. It's a standing pendulum. So you're here in the center, and it goes right and left, right and left, okay? That's your third. Your fourth one, it'll come off your left, down to the right, I love this one. You're gonna grab a hold of the band with both legs, you're now in split squat, split squat. You're gonna hold the band, stand up and back, okay? Come down, stand up and back. Not straight up, go back. Good, good splits. Then we have bridge a bridge, okay? So don't worry, just follow me. I know that's a lot to take in. I'm trying to go fast so we can get right into it. So you have 30 seconds of each of these, three times through, starting with two bear presses and then two fire hydrants, all right? Here we go. So with that bear, make sure, whoopsies, make sure that your knees are just hovering off the floor the whole time. And when you press it out, press from the hips. Don't allow your knees just to turn out. Actually take your whole upper leg and press that band out. Like how we do goal posts with your arms, you're doing that with your legs. All right, guys, here we go. Three, two, and one. Two presses, and then two hydrants. Good work. Two presses, two hydrants. Awesome, keep that head facing forward so your back doesn't become rounded. Good work. You have 10 seconds to go. Then it's going to slide off of one leg and you're going to grab a hold of it. You have a 10 second transition here. Three, two, and one. Slide it off of one leg and it's going to go to the same hand as the leg it's still on. So left hand, left leg. Here we go. Three, two, one. Press that leg back. Press it. Use those glutes. Push that band back. Pull it all the way into your elbow and press it back. Try
Try not to dip into the opposite side. Keep your body in tabletop position. Good work. 10 more seconds. Then we're coming up for that tic-tac pendulum swing. Five, four, three, two, one. Up you come. Wrap it around your ankles. Back and forth. Not high cardio here. Three, two, one. On this, your top of your body is not going here. We're not doing this number. We're gonna stay stable and isolate from your hips down. Keep your feet facing forward, small internal rotation with that ankle to press it out to the side. Good work, guys. 10 more seconds. After this, you're gonna release it from that left leg. Hold on with the right for the split squat. Three, two, one. Off it comes, set it under the right foot. Come back into a deep, deep lunge. You're gonna pull up and back. Three, two, one. Pull that band back. Pull it back. I want you, we did this the last time, but I want you to feel the difference between pulling straight up and pulling back, okay? When you go straight up, it's all quads. When you go back, it's glutes and hands, and that's where we wanna be. Pull it back, pull it back. We have bridge after this. 10 seconds to go. Good job, guys. I love this exercise. Come all the way down in between, all the way down. Pull it all the way up and back. Three, two, and one. Slide it on both legs. After this, we flip over for bear. Three, two, one. Keep those hips up. Press those knees out, out, out. Once again, pushing from the hips, using your hips to your knees as one solid board, pushing it out, not allowing your body to flay open. You're not butterfly. You're just pressing, even, out. Hold those hips up. Good job, guys. Almost there. 10 more seconds, we're gonna flip over and start over, okay? Right back into two bear presses and two hydrants. Three, two, one, flip over, you're already in position. Three, two, one, two presses. Very short transition. Two presses. Boom. Boom. Feel those hips. Whoo! Boom. Boom. Press it out. Good work. Press. Press. In five seconds, you're going to release it from the opposite leg as last time. Three, two, and one. Release it. Grab a hold. You're gonna press it straight back in three, two, one. Press it. So the third time through this will be a longer set because you're gonna do both sides of this, okay? So you'll have an extra 30 seconds on this one and an extra 30 seconds on the split squat the third time through. 15 seconds. Press, press, press. Good work. You're gonna stand up for that pendulum swing next. Three, two, one. Up you come. Put it on both legs. Hold it down by your ankles. The farther down it goes, the harder it is. Three, two, one. You can pull this band all the way up to your knees if you need to. The farther down it is, the harder work this is for you guys and me, for both of us. Good work. Try to keep that the torso nice and stable. Internal rotation with the ankle. Good job, guys. 15 more seconds. John is just going to be late. Good work, guys. Come on, you can do it. Come on, press, 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 press. Five, four, three, two. Release from the opposite leg. It comes under the left foot this time. Split squat. Three, two, one. Pull it up. So next time through, this is the other exercise that we'll do two times. So our next set through will be just a little bit longer and then we'll go back into an AMRAP with three new exercises. Good job, guys. Come on. Keep up the good work. You're killing it. Push back. Don't forget you're pushing back. You're not pushing straight up. Push it back. Get all the way up. 
and all the way down. Full, full range of motion here. Three, two, and one bridge press. I should have said it earlier, sorry. Bridge press, push. All right, ready? Three, two, one, press it out. Press it out, press it out, good. <clears throat> Push. Keep your feet flat on the floor. Hips are elevated into the air. Your feet are not coming off the floor. Big toe stays anchored the whole time. Now don't forget, as soon as this is over, you're right in, in the right spot to flip over and start this whole thing over again. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, flip over. Two bear presses, two hydrants. Two, one, let's do it. Press, press, lift, lift. How high can you get those legs? Come on, get them up, get them up. Press and lift, press and lift, press and lift. Whoo, ha, ah, good work. Awesome. Good job, guys. Five, four, three, two. Release one leg. This is your two. We're going to do these in a row. Grab a hold of it. Press that leg back in three, two, one. Straight back. We're going to do two of these. So you have that 10 second transition so you can get in position. How far back are you pushing this leg? I want that glute engaged, fully engaged. Good job, guys. 10 more seconds, then we're gonna switch sides. Three, two, one. Quick transition, 10 seconds. Switch sides. Here we go. Three, two, one. Press, press. You're here for 30, then you come up to those pendulums or TikToks. Good job, guys. Push it out there. Don't be afraid. Just push that band as far as your body will go. Boom. Boom. Ten more seconds. And three, two, one. Up you come. It goes down to your leg, to your ankles. Rotate back and forth. Three, two, one. Press those legs out. Press them out, press them out, press them out. Good work. As soon as this is done, it slides off the left leg, goes under the right leg for the split squats. Then we'll do the opposite leg. Bridge press, done. Moving into cardio. Push, push, push. We are working all those little bitty muscles that hold your hips in place. Good job, guys. Five seconds. It's gonna slide off the left, hold on with the right. Three, two, one. Slide off the left, stick it under the right. Left leg comes back. Nice big squats. Three, two, one. Pull this up. Yes, it's called a lunge. It's also called a split squat. The fact that we are, our legs are already stabilized, one in front of the other, really makes it more of a squat than a lunge because we're not active in motion. I mean, we are moving, but our feet are anchored. That's why it's called a split squat. Okay, good work. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Good job, come on, keep pushing that leg back. Push it back as you stand up. Almost there. Good work. We're gonna switch feet after this. Three, two, one, switch feet. Here we go, three, two, one, take it down and back. Your back leg is hitting the floor every time. Arms do come forward. They don't rest on top of your knee, but they come forward down to your toe. It's a bigger range of motion than it would be if we were doing just a regular lunge because our chest is doing some work too here. Good job, guys, 10 more seconds. Then we come down on the floor for bridge press, then we're hitting cardio. Almost there, three, two, 
One, wrap that band around your, um, your knees, whichever part of your body is in the middle of your leg. Just above those knees, feet anchored to the floor. Three, two, one. Hips nice and wide, high. Keep those hips up there. Someone is pulling your belly button up to the ceiling. Your feet are flat on the floor. Nice and wide with the knees. Press out as far as you can get it. Give yourself a little extra pulse out on the outside part of this for a little more work. Once you get out there, give me a little pulse. Boom. And then let it back in. That just adds a little more sauce to what you're doing here. Five, four, three, two, and done. I need my water. Okay. So here, moving into the next camera app, you're going to have a band around your hands. <clears throat> Okay, but then, let me just double check this. Okay, so what I did last time, I think what I'm gonna do this time, if you have two bands accessible, this is the right time to use it. You're gonna put one around your, um, your legs, right above your knees, right here. The other one's gonna come on your hands. If you only have one band, I want you to hold it on your arms for the first exercise and the second exercise, legs for the third, okay? So the first exercise is goal post jacks. Your arms are in goal post position and I want you to press them out as you do jacks. Arms go out, hands facing each other. You're there for 10 jumping jacks, 10 jumping jacks. The second exercise will be to tie your shoe. The next exercise will be hands still in the band. You're gonna shuffle one, two, three, then drop and come back up. One, two, three, drop and come back up. If you have a band around your knees, I want you to focus on keeping that band taut the whole time. One, two, three, drop. One, two, three, drop. Every drop counts as one, because remember, we're back to 10 repetitions. So one, two, three, drop, one, two, three, drop. Your third one is gonna be here on your knees, and you're gonna give me four, three, two, one, jump. Okay, four, three, two, one, jump. Four, three, two, one, jump. 10 times through, everything is 10 through. Those are your three exercises. You have three minutes. Goal pose jacks are first. Here we go. And three, two, one. Just give me 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Press that band, then shuffle and drop. Every drop counts as one.
after 10. Move into those high knees. Beautiful. High knees and jump. 30 seconds to go. Woo! to the side. 
Good work. Five more seconds. Then you're gonna come up for a lat pull. You can stay down. Three, two, and one. If you wanna stay down, you pull it here. Pull back. Pull it back. Elbows, I'm gonna stand up. Your elbows are even with your sides, so you're 90 degrees here. Even. Beautiful. Press out on that band. Press it out. Press bicep curls are next. We're gonna do the right arm only this time. 10 more seconds here. Going straight down for bicep curls. I'll show you how to do it. Woo! Five, four, three, two. Grab a hold of it with the left. Kneel down. You're anchored onto the floor with that left. The right arm pulls up and down. Up and down. Good work. Up and up. That's right, the left arm stays anchored to the floor. Right arm is pressing against your knee for stability so that you're really focusing on isolating that bicep. Good work. 10 more seconds. Then we're coming right back into that progression. <clears throat> Five, four, three, two. Grab a hold of the band. Down in the center. Three, two, one. Biceps, deltoids, lats. Deltoids, pecs, release. Beautiful. Boom, press. Don't forget you're pressing every motion. Pressing the whole time. Woo! Your left tricep will be next. Good job, guys. Awesome. Five more seconds. Three, two, one. Left one goes above your head, grab a hold of the right, three, two, press it up. Good work. Now, on these tricep extensions, the farther down your opposite arm is pushing, the harder it is for that tricep to pull the band up to the sky, okay? So really use that opposite arm to pull your front arm down farther and farther and farther. Get the most out of this that you can. You have plank tap outs next. Five, four, three, two, one. Plank down to the floor. Tap it out in three, two, one. Tap, tap, tap. Lat pulls are next. Our shoulders are starting to feel this work. Good job, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Come on up for this lap pull. Pull it out. You don't have to stand. You can. I just wanted to get right into it, so I stayed down on the ground. You may start to feel some blood loss in those shoulders. You can shake it out if you want to before you get back into pulling. You're not falling apart. You just need a little blood. Good work. Whew. Awesome, come on. How much tension can you put on that band when you pull it back? Try not to let it drop down below your belly button. Keep it up nice and high. Five seconds, going into bicep curls on the left side. Three, two, right arm anchors the band to the floor. Come on down, three, two, one, pull it up and release it. Up and release. Up, good work. Now, if you're down too far and you need to go up a little bit higher, just lift your tush up off the floor a little bit. Keep pushing down with that right arm. Release the left in and out to do the work. Next time through, we'll do both arms. Five, four, three, two. Goes on both hands. Bicep curl. Three, two, one. Curl and press. Pull down. Now, this is our third time through. So for the triceps and the biceps, we're gonna do two sets, one per side, okay? So it'll be a little bit longer this time through. Then we're gonna go back into AMRAPs for cardio once again. You've already done the exercises, so you're used to them. Good work, five more seconds. Right tricep is first. Three, two, one, grab a hold. Remember, use that left arm to pull it down. The farther down you pull, the harder this is on that tricep. Push it, push it, push it. Keep your elbow anchored to your head. <coughs> Dip the 
depending on the type of band you have, it may be pulling your hair just a little bit. So just try your best to keep your arm right in there without pulling your hair. Five, four, three, two, switch sides. Same thing, I'm gonna give you a 10 second rest because if you're anything like me, you can't get it right. Three, two, one, press it up. Pull all the way down. Come on, let that arm fall all the way down below your head. See, all the way down to where your head, your hand is at the nape of your neck. Press, press. Don't stop at the crown of your head. Keep pulling all the way down. It comes all the way down to here, okay? Don't stop up at the top, I lost my hand. Oh my gosh. Okay, five more seconds, then tap out. Five, four, three, two, one. Tap it out, down you go. Three, two, one. 30 seconds here, going into lat pull next. Ten more seconds. Lat pull is next. I'm going to stand up for it. Five, four, three, two, one. Up you come. Shake it out. Grab as much tension as you can. And pull. Pull. Don't forget to pull that band apart as you do it. You're not just pulling it in. You're pulling the band apart as you go. You can hold on to it in the center like this, or you can loop your hands through the outside and pull out there. Either one is fine. Just make sure you're getting that tension in, feeling it in the squeeze of your back. Upper back there is doing the work for you. 10 seconds. Then we're going into bicep curls, both sides. Right side will be first. Three, two, one. Right side first. Pull it up and down. Right around here is where I lost you guys on Thursday. So we're gonna, all the rest is brand new. It's all brand new for you. Guys, Friday's workout with the jump rope, we had two people break the ropes. Two. That's not good. 10 seconds of switch sides. Five, four, three, two. Stay down, switch sides. Come on, curl it up. Curl it up. Curl. Good work. Come on, you got it. Awesome. 15 seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one and done. Back to cardio. here you've already done it you know what to do the three exercises just to repeat you got to press out to a squat jack and that isn't right at all press it that was totally wrong but it was fun to say press out to a jump squat press out jump squat press out jump squat then you have two bear is it right oh bear jack plank jack bear jack plank jack then you have the archer poles okay 10 of each for three minutes. Press, jump, press, jump. Then bear, plank, bear, plank, then archer. All right, hang on guys, you get two seconds while I fix my hair. Always a sign of needing a new band when I keep having to fix my ponytail. Here we go guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Press and jump, press and jump. Keep pressure in that band even when you jump.
work. Take off the band, come up to that archer pull with a lunge, jumping lunge, 10 per side. Melissa did. Tim did. Claudia did. Good work, guys. All right. Catch your breath. Let that heart rate come down. Abs. Abs. All right. Good work, guys. 
guys, come on. Next thing, your legs will go straight up in the air. You're gonna press out with a crunch. Five, four, three, two. Legs are up, press out. Up and out, ow, ow, yes. Feel the pain. Woo. Try to keep those legs as straight as possible as you do this. Bring your torso up as you squeeze out. Press out with the legs, bring the torso up. Every time you crunch, press it, press it. 10 seconds to go. <coughs> then you're gonna stand up with the band around your feet. Three, two, and one. 10 second transition. Stand up, knee to elbow. Three, two, one. Pull those knees up. Twist to the, to the elbow. Sorry, twist your elbow to your knee. Here's the trick. Don't let this knee come across your body. Straight up with the knee, straight up. The only thing turning is your upper torso, okay? You got this, guys. Almost there. Five, four, three, two. Drop it off the left, grab a hold on the right, bend to the left in three, two, one. Bend it. Bend it like Beckham. Okay, when you do this, guys, make sure that your knee is pointing straight to your hip, straight to your elbow, straight to your ankle. Not in front and not in back. Dead to the side, straight below you, okay? Good work. Almost there. Awesome, go as far as you can. You're gonna do the opposite side next time. Five, four, three, two, comes onto your feet for that wicked, wicked flutter kick. Three, two, and one. Good. Head is just off the floor. My family is giving you a parade. Hi. In the background. So keep those feet pressing out to the side as you do this. Feet pressing out, lifting with those ankles, one over the other, legs straight. Nine seconds to go. Three, two, one. Ten second rest, bicycle kicks. Bicycle crunches, I mean. Three, two, one, bicycles. Don't forget to rotate. Rotate, rotate, rotate. Rotate through those shoulders. Shoulder to knee, not elbow to knee. Shoulder to knee. Five more seconds. Then legs straight up in the air. Three, two, and one. Press and crunch. Press and crunch. Try to keep those legs straight as you press it out. Feel the pain. Mamma mia. Woo! Good work, guys. You got this. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, up you come. Twist, knee to shoulder, knee to elbow. Three, two, one, pull it up, pull it up, pull it up, pull it up. Pull it up. How about those hip flexors right now, huh? Bring on your adductors as well, adductors abductors. Everything right on the inside, outside. Twist, 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 twist. Almost there. Come on. You're going to drop it from the right foot. Hold on with the left. Five, four, three, two. Drop with the right, grab with the left. Arm up, down we go. Off to the side. 30 seconds. Flutter kicks are next. <coughs> Excuse me. Good, we're doing good on time. Beautiful, come on. Good work, 10 more seconds. Flutter kicks are after. Five, four, three, two. Flutter kicks, flutter kicks. Oh, the joy of flutter kicks. Here we go, guys. 
three, two, one. All right, guys, come on. How much distance can you get in that band as you kick it out? All right, I gotta scoop it. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Ten second rest. Bicycles are next. Last time through. Three, two, one. Push, 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 push. You didn't know that ab work can have so much hip work in it, did you? Thank you, Bam. After this one, those legs go straight up in the air. Crunch and press. Three, two, one. Legs go up. Press and crunch, press and crunch, press and crunch. Exhale on the way up. Every time you press out, give me an exhalation. That's when you're lifting your shoulders as well. Inhale on the way down. Little bitty puffs, just like you're in labor, which it kind of probably feels like at this point. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, stand up, knee to elbow, three, two, one, come on, don't forget, that knee is not crossing your body, your shoulders are rotating, your knees are not rotating, they're lifting, but not rotating, transverse abdominis being worked on here, everything that goes across your body, good work guys. Almost there, almost there, almost there. 10 more seconds. Then you're going to drop it from your left. Hold on with the right. Five, four, three, two. Drop it from the left. Grab a hold with the right. Pull it up and over. Three, two, one. Straight down. Now, this is the one that we're doubling up. Each side gets 30 seconds. Good work, guys. Oh, I'm so hoping you'll feel this in the next day or two. I love band work. It gets all those teeny tiny places that we forget about. Good job, 10 seconds. And then we're gonna switch sides, then we've got flutter kicks, and then you get to go on with your merry day. Three, two, one, switch sides. Arm up, take it down. Good job, guys. Flutter kicks are next. Come on, get down as far as you can go. Don't forget, shoulder, elbow, not going in front of your body, not going behind your body. Tracing a line right down the side of you. If you need to use your hand for guidance, you can do that. Be very careful not to buckle your hip, not to let it go forward, okay? Keep it steady, steady, steady. 10 more seconds. You will know when you have it in the right spot, because when you have it in the wrong spot, you can tell because it feels like nothing. Five, four, three, two, and one. Down to the floor. Flutter kicks. Oh, last one. Three, two, one. 30 seconds of pressure here. Tall. Don't 
flutter your body. Just let it sit there. Good, good work. So tomorrow I'm at the Y, even though it's outside and chilly. At 11, you gotta sign up in advance. But I'd love to see you there. We will have a workout on Saturday at Winona. Good job. I'm gonna keep going in person as long as you show up. There we go. Arm to the opposite side, turn that torso. Good work. Switch sides. This is gonna feel really, really good. You may wanna find yourself doing this again later today. Just stretch out all those fine muscles that we used, okay? Let's repeat this, come back to butterfly, chest up. Good work. And one more time on the outside, both legs go out, arm comes across, give yourself a hug. Switch sides. Good work. Both hands on the floor, feet on the floor, chest in the air, grab hold of your toes. Roll it up slowly, one vertebrae at a time. Push those hands out, thumbs down, head down. And release, go opposite direction. Big deep breath. Release it. And you guys have a wonderful day. See you later, alligator.